Hello guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. In this video, I will be telling you a bit about my collaboration with Samsung and how I've been using the Galaxy S22 Ultra phone lately to create content for you guys, but also a lot of other things. I'm just gonna share why I think it's a pretty awesome phone, especially if you're an athlete or if you have an active lifestyle. I did also make another video on the Galaxy 5 Watch Pro. Um, which really does have a lot of features that are very appealing to athletes or people that just care about their health and optimizing it. But for today, we are going to talk a little bit about this phone and the features that I find super cool on it. Um, the first one of them is probably the fact that you can do two different types of recognition. I've previously had issues with the face ID because when I'm wearing glasses or even just a helmet sometimes, when I'm training or skating or a hoodie on, and I want to see, uh, let's say I've been using this grass board lately, muscle oxygen, and I want to check up on my muscle oxygen levels, or if I'm doing a threshold test, well, then it doesn't recognize my face because I'm wearing glasses. Whereas here, if you can see, well, now it already did recognize my face, but it also allows you to just do a finger touch and open the screen. Um, so having both of those is very simple. So usually I don't need it because it'll recognize my face before, I even get to that point, but having the option of unlocking your phone with the thumb is really sweet. So that's a big plus for me in this phone. Obviously, I wanted the big screen. Um, at the two previous Olympic Games, they actually gave us Samsung phones. It was a participant gift. Thumbs up, um, kudos on, on that Samsung, really cool. Um, but they gave us, at the previous, this one's 2022, they gave us the flip phone. Really fancy phone, uh, it has a lot of cool things about it, but the videography and pho photography um, options and quality was not the highlight of the phone, which is a lot of, the, I mean, a big reason of, or big part of what I use my phone for is just filming content or videos, shooting things from my practice, whether it's for myself to just review technically or to discuss over with my coaches, or if it's to share with all you guys out there, then I do really need a good camera and a good video camera. I actually sold those phones and it was just here lately this summer that I ended up in this conversation with Samsung where they told me that they actually have some phones with a ridiculously good camera. Uh, this one has more than 100, it has 108 megapixels, which is pretty mind blowing if you ask me. I will just show you a, a photo that I took with this phone on a bike ride and uh, as you can see, quality is pretty decent. Um, for me, the biggest difference from previous phones has been the colors. Um, it's just more colorful. You can really, I think that's the thing most of us can, um, like can, can recognize that feeling when you see something incredibly beautiful in real life, like a, a nice view or just the scenery. And then when you capture it on the camera, it's not the same thing. I really find that the Samsung here comes very close to replicating that actual view of of it um so that's been really nice obviously that's something nice when i'm sharing it with you guys that i want you to see the way i saw it so whether that's skating exercises or a vlog for my daily life it's a big plus another nice feature is the night vision or night mode uh which is not only for use in the night but i found it um when ice skating we tend to do that indoors especially in the summer you don't find cold places like that yet so at the rink it's very dark and there's very few windows. And that's one of the really cool parts about this phone. You got the night mode. So whether it's dark or not, I get pretty high quality video content. And it's a lot easier, especially when zooming in to see all the details and, and use that for like my own review of it or to share with you. So talking about sports, another feature again about the camera is that it has a steady hands function. So like you can imagine when I'm filming myself or filming somebody else, we generally go at a high pace, at least the cool videos. Um, so so hanging, having a camera and a phone that makes up for all that uh, shaking that we, we can't really avoid it on the skates uh, is just very nice. It kind of gives you the sensation of having a gimbal to, to smoothen out the movements, even though it's just a phone. Um, this is not actually about sports, but just convenient for any, any person that would want to watch, watch your videos on it. The screen, really uses the entire screen. Um, when you're watching a Netflix show or whatever you're into um, videos, then you can do like that and it's it fills out the entire screen. I mean, if you look up here at the top of it, just, you can see here that 
even the little video camera or uh, camera here in the front is even surrounded by the screen. So use every inch of the screen, which makes the screen very big. And there's a lot of other nice features that I, uh, I'm not gonna mention all of them. If you wanna read more about them, you can just click in the Samsung link. There will be a link below, of course, for you to check out the website. If you watch the video on the watch here, cause um, I think you'll find that too if you don't have Samsung products yet. If you get Samsung products, you will quickly find how this whole system of Samsung devices works incredibly well together. I happen to have a Samsung TV before I even started this collab with Samsung. So things like being able to start that with the phone or being able to start music with the watch and the earbuds, it, how it's all interconnected just makes uh, life simple in a way. It's, it's smoother and you just save a lot of time. Thanks for watching this one. I hope you wanna give the Samsung um, phone a try. Again, this was the S22 Ultra. So really the top end of it and without doubt the best camera, <laughs> honestly. Uh, phone and not just camera I've ever tried in my life. Same goes for uh, the video camera. So um, big thumbs up for um, for that. And um, yeah, obviously you're gonna see the content I'll, I'll shoot with it on this channel in the near future. See you for the next video.